first person you can imagine in charge of a blood bank. Well, how about Count Dracula? John Pilkington was set up by his mate Chris Gibson and found himself working in our blood bank, where the boss was a very strange chap with very odd habits. Uh, by the way, everything that you see is fruit juice. Cheers. Basically, your first task today would be to just, if you could just stick labels on the bottles that are yes. there. Everything there is, I think, abiresis negative. Um, just a second, I just have a just... Yes, that came from that batch. Um, do you know anything about blood? No, not it's extraordinary. It can be yes. almost, it can be kind of addictive. Really, over the years, you get used to it. You get you become quite a passion. Yeah. Look at that. There's a viscosity on that. The way it clings to the side of the flask. Yeah. It's almost like like wine. Do you know you see these people on these yeah, yeah. food programs about wine? They say, yeah. "Oh, it reminds me of a good afternoon in the door dying and all that," and, and you can get the bouquet. Do you know what I mean? You might become interested in this as a career, but... Don't yeah. forget, it's not real blood, only blackcurrant juice. It's certainly a def definite, definite became I mean, a different, different, different to that, for example. See? Subtle, a little more... Yeah, it was more... More flinty. Yeah. This is more, certainly more flinty. That's probably Australian. They'd be rhesus negative. <laughs> just, just double check. <laughs> Let's send in our man from the British Medical Association who's heard strange rumours about this establishment. Good morning. Good morning. My name's Mills, Terence Mills, from the British Medical Association. Okay. Is uh, Mr Lampton yeah. around? He's just popped out for tea. He said he'll be back in two seconds. He's just walked out. I've just started here five seconds ago. I'm actually investigating some allegations of impropriety in working practices in this establishment. Have you noticed anything no, unusual no. at all? Have you met <laughs> Mr. Lampton? Yeah, I've just met him just now, yes. Mm -hmm. yeah, he seems perfectly normal. Yeah, seems right to me, yeah. Well, after, <laughs> it's, it's, oh, um, obviously. it's obviously a very serious matter. Yes. Okay, I hope to hear from you. Yes, okay. Thank, Thank, Thank you. Very much. All right. The boss is back, looking and acting a little more like Dracula. Uh, anyway, how are you, how are you enjoying yes. yeah. you, you yeah. That, that, That's perfect. Just like that's that's perfectly enjoying. all right, yes, 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 that'll be very clear. Negative that, that is a bit unique. I was trying to explain to you before about it, yeah. okay? But... <laughs> it becomes a bit addictive after a while. Sometimes I stay here and I work right through the night, you know, testing random samples and putting them and sorting out, and the night just goes, goes, goes away. So, what do I, if that's. <clears throat> Well, that doesn't do nothing to you, does it, at all? Oh, no, this has all been irradiated and or anything like that. No, but it's just, it's so delicious. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah, oh, well, I'll just leave it around because yeah. I'll, I'll just pop on and see, keep the other lot on the boil in the next okay. building. I'll be back in a few minutes. Okay. Oh, well, if you feel like a drink, help yourself. <laughs> To do? Just label these up. Label the, these blood samples? Yes, yeah, just label them. A, B, A, A, B, R, negative. How did he test them? I'm not sure. I didn't see him test them. <laughs> so you're perfectly happy doing that? It could be quite serious if there's a mistake, you know. Yeah, well, I'm You're aware sure. of that? Oh, I don't know. I'm not I'll sure. go and sort this out and I'll, I'll try and... Yes. Okay. I'll try and pop back. Thank you. Now the boss is a fully fledged vampire. He keeps asking me if I've seen anything suspicious. Oh, you didn't tell him anything, did you? No, I said nothing. He said, no, I just come in and he told me to do that. Fine, OK, if you could just press yeah. on with doing that. Yeah. Time. Makes it very difficult for people who just want to carry on with their lives quietly. <clears throat> so, did you have a... Did you have a drink while I was away? Nah. Mm. <laughs> Can't drink you now? Nah. Oh, I hate to drink alone, you see. That's 
Give me a... It's something you get used to. Weeks. I might. <sighs> I'm trying to get down to three of these a day. The class when we've seen you do any tests and things like that, I've said, oh. that was all there. He said, you know, it could be down to you if anything goes wrong. I said, I've only started. Don't take any notice of it, the man's a trouble on yeah. He's got no sense of humour, I don't know. Yeah, I know, he's, I've just said to him, he's trying to put me off, I've only just been it seven minutes. Mm. Oh. Apart from that, do you think you might have a career in the blood business? Yeah, I don't mind, I'm, I think it's quite good already. <laughs> ah. Here comes our BMA snooper again. Is this Mr Lampton? Oh, good morning, yes. Yes. A hundred and fifty pints of blood were delivered here last week, and only fifty went out. What happened to the other hundred? Well, natural wastage. Excuse me, what? Enter Count Bijula. <laughs> I know, I know what you're saying. I know. 